Welcome everyone back to Commonwealth of DK. Uh, today we are uh, gonna try and continue on with the Master Crafter uh, Project X uh, mission, which is uh, unlocking or we have to find the blueprint for bobby pins so we could create bobby pins, which is uh, definitely something because I don't like to buy them. Um, don't like, uh, I'm happy to find them and, you know, so that's, that'll be a good little, uh, good little side thing because I break bobby pins a lot. Um, so let's see, where is it going to be? Oh, it's at Grey Garden. Okay. Grey Garden has been discovered, but is not a settlement of mine. Um... I'm contemplating whether or not I should turn it into a settlement. Um, it's really hard to, to uh, defend, um, especially if I'm a horde. I guess if we have the resources, we'll we'll uh, we'll see. Let's uh, let's. Let's cross that bridge when we get to it. So let's go on. And um, so we are here in Sanctuary. So we're going to take a safe route. We'll come down here to Abernathy. Um, we will um, come. And then we will shoot across the... the the uh, field to Drummond and then come down that road and then up. That's probably the safest route. We are going to avoid, uh, what is this, Concord? Uh, because they, uh, the spawn rate for them to respawn in there is ridiculous. So, we're going to try to avoid Red Rocket because I'm sure that that has um, spawned by now. What time is it? We are at 1.30. Sanctuary is making 54 out of 100. Something. Hostiles have a have been attracted to the energy and the noise at Sanctuary. Okay. That means we ain't going nowhere, and we must we must be prepared to defend ourselves. So, up to the skylines. Now we have to move up. Okay, so let's, uh... Ada and our um, settlers will tell us where they're coming from. Where are they coming from? They could come from here. Uh, by by way of the vault. Uh, they can uh, come across the bridge. The bridge is heavily defended. So anybody who attempts to cross this bridge uninvited without a a golden letter of invitation is gonna be um, sent home packet the only one that is uh, That is our weakest, is this area here. I hear gunfire. Oh, okay, they're coming from the vault. Federal rations, okay. 
Hey, we need help out here. Don't shoot them until they get between the until they get inside the green things. Okay, they're trying to avoid us. Go get him, doggo! But don't die! Only head... Not him! Come on, give me the head. Give me the head. There we go. That was a 13% chance of hitting it, so I thought I'd try just to shoot and make me feel better. Well, this guy over here... He's trying to sneak around. Oh, no. Oh. Get him, Ada. There you go. That's right, we will rip, we will be victorious. Even though the health is gone, unless you hit him in the head or blow him up, he's gonna keep coming after you. I wanna throw a uh Molotov in there, but I don't want to kill Ada. Oh no, a, blo uh, a bloater. Or a glowing one. He has, uh, he has uh, the, the ability to bring them all back to life. Pretty tough. Okay, is that all of them? Well, my thing still says I'm in danger. Is there any more over there? I'm just gonna shoot and just in case. Okay, show some caution. Let's drop down. Ever so gently, we fall like a swan, a graceful swan. No, you stay here, defend the home front. Oh, hold on, I don't think I'm in the... There we go. Who isn't in the green field? Okay, so the green field is here. You barely. It's too heavy to carry. Badass. Pick you up. Pick you up again. Ah, you keep wanting to fall. Pick you up. And. Treat you like a rag doll. I'll drop you off. Am I gonna be able to pick you up? I am. Hunters are stalking me. Let them come.
too heavy to carry. You're also too heavy to carry. Oh shit! Run! Ada, save me! Sacrifice yourself for me! Because I'm more important! Oh, that's right. Resistance is futile. What are you, a Borg? Okay, you're still on the defense. That means one is still hanging about. Where is he? Where is he? Oh. No, thank you. You stay here. Kill hunters. I'm collecting bodies. I'm the mortician in this town. Gangrous feral ghoul. Ghoul. Can I pick you up? I may talk a tough game, but when it comes down to it, um, I'm going to run like a scared little girl into my safety zones where Ada and my fellow survivors will protect me because I'm more important than they are. We should leave these bodies for the next ones who try to attack. Any more? Yeah, here. Pick you up. Bring you around. This was such a nice town until the zombie apocalypse. Oh, I lost one of my survivors. And I think he is the one that I rescued from... I don't know where I... But as long as he don't turn into a zombie and stays dead, he's fine. That means there's one less person working the fields. That means I gotta go get another survivor. Oh, you decided you want to... Fifty percent shot of the head? Got him just before he got me. And he stayed within the green wall. Let's pick up this leg. He was one of the hunters who decided to um, have lunch before he went hunting. Oh, doggo! Oh, my friend. Rest in peace, doggo. Rest in peace.
Well, I'm sad to say we are in a survival situation, so even though doggy dog meat is a hero to the settlement of sanctuary, we um we are gonna honor him by devouring and using him for um, other our other needs our survival needs so rest in peace our favorite doggo We lost two heroes today. You're gonna scrap the zombies without any words. But our two heroes lie side by side hold on hold on let's um come up there and lay them next to each other there we go Oh, hold on, we have another disgraceful feral came to attack us unprovoked. Okay. Um Oh, we can't scrap them. Which is best. So we're gonna say um, something poetry and poignant and um, something wise. I don't know, ashes to ashes, uh, dust to dust. They both, uh, on this Memorial Day weekend, they both gave their lives for for the settlement of sanctuary so that we all may have freedom and uh, a will to live and everything nice and poignant. So these are our two heroes and we'll go ahead and empty out their inventories leave them leave them in heroes embrace here's another disgraceful zombie who attacked us unprovokedly um too bad we can't take their heads off and then uh put them on stakes out in front like the raiders do to discourage anybody else from wanting to attack us. Okay. All right, so we lost two of our of our settlers here and um, obviously these guys are heartbroken because they went right back to work. They're throwing themselves into their work. Yeah, well, we lost two today, Ada. Get over it. Okay, so let's uh, dump everything that we don't need. Um, I keep forgetting we have this uh, this rifle. Um, what else can we uh, dump? Uh, 
let's break this pistol down. We're gonna break down what we don't need. We get we'll get um uh you know we'll get materials from it. Um we could move all this over. Leather right leg doggo's glasses. Ah, you know what? I think I might want to keep those for myself. As, you know, membranes. Dirty blue suit. I want to put that on our um, vendor instead of the, the army fatigues. Um, let's see. What else? What else? Uh, ammo. We don't need a 50 cal. Or 5.56. Five, Drop the bolts. Uh, we don't need explosive bolts. I don't think we have anything to shoot them with. We don't have a shotgun shell. Um, we have... Do we have any 45 rounds? We do. So we're gonna... Um, I think... Let's go ahead and close this. Let's take a look at this bayoneted um, light receiver. I would like to make this an automatic, actually. Um, I need gun nut three. Oh, that would be that would be pretty nice. No, the three oh eight's a kind of the the. Ammo for 308 is kind of heavy. 38s would be nice because it's plentiful. Um, okay, I don't have gun nuts, so what? 58. That ain't bad. Um, armor piercing improves the rate of fire and armor penetration, reduces range and in your damage so 22 but 22 rapid fire and this is um I think I would probably want auto piercing when they're and not so much as um I okay what's the weight Okay, uh, this one is uh, 0.5, and this one is 0.1. Okay, so that really is the difference. This one, the lighter. So the standard is 15.9, light is 12.2. Um, okay, let's let's go with the uh, harder. Auto piercing. Um, can we make it? Uh, a short light barrel. That reduces the weight a bit. So let's do that. Um, short stock. Oh, I need. I would need. Um, gun at three to do anything higher on this. Standard magazine. Let's do a large magazine. Short scope. Uh, We're not trying to make this our. Um, not trying to make this our, you know, long range weapon. This is good. A short. Short. Um, running gun. Let's just do uh, glow sights. Okay. What do we need? We need gun at four to and more adhesive to make us pressed. Um, yeah, we'll leave the, the large bayonet in case we get too close or they get too close. We could just stab them with it. 
Um, oh, I forgot to break down everything else. Duh. Uh, pipe pistol. So let's break this down. I'll only get a steel. And steel. Targeted crossbow. What do, what do we get for this? Compensated bow. Okay. Shock bolt. Standard stock. Heavy string. Medium night vision. Bashing. No. Not doing anything with that. Okay, so that is it. We didn't really get much from um, from breaking down the those guns, but that's fine. Where is that uh, target of crossbow? We'll move that over. Signal grenades. Okay. Um, I think uh, we need. Do we need any ammo? Um, ten millimeter. We have four hundred. Um, and with the Colt, we have sixty-six. And our, we have. 122 for our our um, gun here. Let me go ahead and favorite this. Um, let's favorite it here. Actually, let's favorite it there. It's getting late. Um, we are gonna go, actually, let's do this. So we have, we have to rescue at the Federal Ration, which I believe is there by, is it Abernathy or, let's see, where is it by? Sunshine. Okay, so. That's kind of in in the direction we're trying to go, right? So we could um, come down, work our way down here to Great Garden. Um, we can uh, pick up the bobby pin, and then we can make our way back here to Sunshine Tidings, uh, and then rescue this guy here at Sunshine Tidings. And bring them back to Sunshine Tidings. Um, I think that's actually it's 5 p.m. So let's uh, that battle took a little longer than we wanted. So let's go ahead and uh, sleep until the morning. Then we can uh, get an early start. I think that's going to be our our smarter move. Even though the sun's up, it's um, it's smarter to uh, do that. Uh, let's go ahead and sleep until six. Okay, I'm actually wondering, do we have the materials to um, build the robot? Let's, um, let's see if we can build the robot here. Do. And um, 
Do we have enough to build an actual robot? Let's see. You lack rubber, circuits, Sierra, uh, ceramic, aluminum, and adhesive. Okay. So uh, let's go ahead and tag those. Exit. Did I actually tag it? Tag for research. So A for research, right? Okay, it didn't. It didn't tag it, but you have an idea. At least uh, we have the, the the ability to build. And we need to go and uh, start collecting some stuff. Let's go ahead and eat. We always have to be scrounging for materials. Keep this dick keep closed. Okay. Um, so... We're gonna do the same process as we talked about earlier. We're gonna avoid red rocket because they spawn. No, we don't want we don't want the dinner bell. I should name that dinner bell. Okay, so we are. Yep, yeah, see? I got a whole bunch of them over there. Let's just avoid. Okay, I wonder if these if these flies are gonna be a nuisance. Just can't let bygones be bygones, can't you? Oh, he hit me. Okay. Well, we won't have to see them for a little bit. They will respawn in about an hour. Make sure nothing there can be picked. And or harvest. Okay. Our um, sneak is moving, but I believe that's just our um, guns up there. We should have ample um, defense here. So there's a gate. Yeah, let's close this gate. And close this gate too. I wonder. I don't really want to bring people here until Sanctuary starts getting over full. Yeah, we know. I we know. Quiet. To this. Keep those to thoughts to yourself, to weirdo. I need to assign someone to this. 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 Okay, so we got all the potatoes. To assign someone to now this. we're going to I move to on over to. to I need to assign uh, here's a little campfire where the traders would normally come and gather. 
Um, I need to assign we don't some have for traders in this game that go from settlement to settlement. So we need to go to them or create our own trader like we did in Sanctuary. We're going to turn Sanctuary into a bustling metropolis. Oh, okay. I'm about to say. Oh. I should just kill you and put you out of your misery. Since I already took care of your family, I unalived your family. Um, did I not clear everything out? I did. Okay. Slowly we are making our way to Drum and Diner. Uh, the Gorski cabin is right over here and uh, we're just coming on the outskirts of Concord try to avoid that all together and um, let's see let's uh, keep going down this direction And starting to sound like one of those walking uh, tourist people and we're walking and we're walking So far, so good. No, no, um, crowded, um, hordes of, of, um, pharaohs looking to get our autograph, chasing us down for a piece of clothing or memento. We don't need anything from Drummond. You know what? We should check to see if they have a uh, suppressed um, a suppression for the uh, for the rifle that we have. That way. Oh, okay. Everything is is um, highlight is green, so it did. Um, pick up. All right, that's nice. That that tells us, hey, you need that for a robot. Let's go ahead and talk. Hey, Scava, let's trade. Best scrap in the Commonwealth. Um, let's see. Hey, Scava, let's trade. Let's see what you have. Nope, doesn't look like they have any suppressed, suppressed um, weaponry. Oh yeah, we do have our canvas backpack on. Um, oh, I forgot to put my blue suit on. On our, uh, our dude. Um, Overseer gives us 10 protection, 10 cold, and 10 radiation. What is dog meat? Dog meat gives us a lot more. No protection, though, but protection against poison, fire, shock, cold and radiation 50 radiation actually and the overseer is 30 so for 10 um you know what let's just 
Hey, the value is 2,000. And my charisma is not that high. Um, that'd be a, that's a good little selling point. I don't, does, does this one have anything that I need desperately? You know what? We could probably take all of her junk. Um, we could probably take all of her junk and still get money back. Let's, um, let's take a look. Oh, wow. These, the Google, the goggles that I want is only valued at 300, but these overseer are at 2000. So let's sell that. Let's take everything with the little spyglass next to it. Cause that's, it indicates that's what we're looking for. So let's take this, this, um, Take oil, always take oil. Duct tape. Um, lighters. Hot plates. Um, plunger, we need rubbers. Oh, oh you know, actually we, we could take some shipments. What um, shipment do we want? A two thousand dollars for a shipment of rubber? Come on now. Okay, we still have a um, thousand dollars worth of stuff. Sixteen hundred dollars worth of stuff we need to take from her. So we're not going to do the rubber because that's two thousand. Um, probably do the oil. We're getting a, a, a lot of fertilizer, so we don't need that. Uh, copper, we don't really need. Concrete, not really. Ceramic is only 800. That's about half, so let's take that. Um, Take the antiseptic, because we're probably going to need antiseptic for any kind of healing. Um, let's take bag as fertilizer. <laughs> Baseball. I'll take uh, cameras with the crystals. Yeah. Um... That claw high just gives us like five leather, but we don't really need that. We'll take the blood sack for antiseptic. Um, that weighs eight. That might probably take us um, way over the limit as far as our carry capacity or up to the limit. So let's um, see if we can get anything else. Ooh. Lead, we need, we need lead for an acid. We need lead for our ammunition. We need acid for healing. So, I'm gonna take that. Um, don't really need fiberglass. We don't really need silver that I could think of. Okay, so we need to, let's um, take ammo then, huh? Um, let's get our, oh, she don't have any 10 millimeter. Oh, she does here. We'll take that. There. Okay. And, um, and then she's still going to give us 88, uh, 88 caps back. So, um, what are these worth? $5 each. So, no, we won't. Um, uh, I think that's good enough. All right. I think that was a good trade. Let's go ahead and put our um, goggles on. How do we look? 
How do we look? Hold on, let's do this. How do we look? Oh, they don't show. Okay. But they're on. Okay. Um, probably just another mod glitch. Um, okay. Let's see if we can make a deal. So... I've got a few minutes to browse. We're... We're early still. It's 7 a.m. Alright, um, I wonder just to... Let's see if, uh... She has the cure. She does have the cure. Should I go ahead and grab one? It's 245. That's going to take up all of our... All of our coin, but... It's better to save and have it... And not need it than to need it and not have it. Um... She has a lot of other junk, too. How much is a pencil? 60. <clears throat> okay, you know what? I'm gonna... I'm gonna pull the trigger on that one. Can I sell her back anything? Um... <laughs> Do I have any, um... <laughs> I could sell her some death tags, uh, some bloater tags, um, hunter tags, what else, what else, what else, oh, pre-war money, okay, um, I think that's really about it, but you know, we're only paying 39, 39 for, oh, here's a huge stack of, wow, it doesn't weigh anything and it's worth 4,000. So we'll keep that for the, for another time. Um, go ahead and accept that 39, 39, uh, Caps for a uh, cure that is a pretty good deal. I think we actually uh, need to get out of here before they realize we robbed them. Gave them a bogus deal. Okay. Um. Keeping an eye out, keeping... Now we're uh, slowly making our way. Now I believe there is a zombie horde that likes to hang out over in this direction. So let's um, try to break a uh, line of sight by coming down here and not allowing them to actually see us that was that there is the entrance to the switchboard we haven't been in there since episode seven or eight Okay, now we could come up here and get back on the road. Pretty sure we are safe and out of sight. Yeah, um, it just occurred to me that um, that uh, Great Garden may have be overrun with a horde of ferals and bloaters and 
all kinds of other nasty stuff. So, we can't just walk in nonchalantly. I think we need to um, approach it from the top of the hill and um, yeah, just got some roaches. I think we need to approach it from the top of the hill And I think we're going to have to clear out all of the, the zombies and not zombies. Sorry. I have to clear out all the ferals and the, um, uh, the, 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 the hairless hamsters. Okay. Any of them here? Here we go, there they are. Where'd it go? Okay. Here they come. Oh shit! More than one. Okay, hold on. What do I have set as my... Oh, I do have Molotov. Can't touch me! Okay, you're stuck on a car. One down, 50 to go. I don't want to get too close and activate the, uh, the mole rats. There they are, that's what their name is. Gotta keep track of where the other ones are. There are a few slow pokes. Get around the slow pokes. Come on, hit the head already. So I do our music. I didn't attract any more, did I? Okay. Oh, there's one more over here, that's why. He probably don't got no legs or anything. Yeah. Okay, so let's go and be uh, stabby stabby. down okay all right that was a little interesting okay so 
now that we took care of all of the zombies, now the next task is taking care of all of the mole rats. Um, we have how many... You know what? Let's go ahead and do the, the, the big boom. The big bada boom. It says I am detected. Gotcha. There were two of them. Did I get both of them? So the mole rats and the zombies, you know, they uh They're good friends, apparently. That's a good way just to irritate some people. Okay, so we, um, we are, I think, Activated everybody. Oh, there's something in here that we need. Almost, almost. Bobby pins, nice. Combo, duct tape, and a wrench. Let's just steal. We'll take the pipe pistol with us. We'll take his stuff as well. Sweet. Now, hopefully, one of the um, perks of coming in here. Oh, I must have blew him up as well. Is uh, the the Adam dudes? They. Um, have some really good nuke related um... oh this one is a recon 3.8 pipe revolver sniper rifle and a polymer strength armor right leg okay great now I'm carrying too much okay see a nuke of grenades yeah see they they have some great uh, nuka grenades. All right, so how much am I over? Yeah, three pounds. Let's go ahead and drop three pounds in. We'll drop it in here so that we can um, get up later. You know what? Um, the soup. We were stupid enough to go out and bring it with us and not. Let's go ahead. Uh, this is a right leg. It's middle leg. Right. Um, was it right? Right leg. Yes. So uh, it gives me 11 and 11. And what does my right leg give me here? Eight. And this is four. This is six. So let's go ahead and drop this. And then we'll equip the other one. It gives us a little bit more protection and um, we lost some weight so now we can can we no we can't break into any of this all right um well, we probably could have broke some things down Can't break the code. As a matter of fact, let's do that. I think we could, um, we could turn it into, um, we turn it into like cloth, I think it is, and steel. So we could take them from uh, a three pounds to a point, 
to a point one pound or something. So this right leg weighs four pounds. So if we scrap it, it becomes steel. And the suit, three, it's three pounds. But if we scrap it, it becomes cloth. We exit and now our weight is back to 241. All right. Um, back to the handgun. We'll get some caps and some... I don't think we could gain anything from breaking those racks down. They do give you some protection against radiation, but very little. Take some cycle and some buff out. All right, my thing is uh, moving, so somebody is aware of us about being around here. Here is the other child, child of Adam. Okay, he has some insta mash and a melon. I think there's uh, another one up here, or maybe it's just ammo. Yeah. Some sugar bombs. But well, we only got one. Um, we'll leave the shotgun shells. So we only got one. Um, I think there's another. We got one grenade, nuka grenade. I think if we shoot like right around here. I'm not sure if there's another one or not. Maybe further down there, but we're not gonna. All right, now we're carrying too much. Um, I think it was the mole rat meat. You know what? Let's go ahead and drop the feral meat. Oh, that's point three. What is the mole rat meat way? Caring too much, so we need to, you know what, let's eat something then. Um, we could drop that. Insta mash, we'll eat some. There, right, now we're down to 244. Four. How much does the mole wrap meat weigh? 0.5, so that's gonna take us over. So it's the teeth, but the fat, we'll use that. And if we do take over the, um, yeah, there's another one in here. If we do take over Sunshine, um, not Sunshine Tidings, but their Grey Garden again. Then we could dump everything in there. There's another nuka grenade. So, are we going to be able to carry it? Yeah, we are. We don't need this. What is simple racks? Oh, okay. Oh, there's another one here. So, there's my other nuka grenade. No, I'm carrying too much. I need to drop a, a pound. All right. Now, let's move on 
to Sunshine Tidings. I mean, not Sunshine Tidings. Um, Grey Garden. We're going to take a peeky here in Grey Garden to see what the situation is. Have, have they been... Oh, yep. I could see one walking around now. Yeah, I could see them over there. Um, the thing is, I don't want to just, uh... Oh, you know what I can do is that what I did before... Draw them into the, uh... The, the thing here. And kill them that way. Okay, um, let's, uh, take a look. Is there anything over here? No. Okay, so this is what I'm going to do. I'm going to draw them away. Now, do I have a stealth boy? I do. I have one stealth boy. Well, I'm gonna take, I'm gonna take that and try and maneuver around to the the bridge, and then um, and then draw them all. Oh, okay. We can harvest some melon seeds. We're gonna draw them down into. The funnel of the railroad, uh, railroad, um, uh, bridge, and then we're going to blast them. Okay, maybe I don't need it still. But I will need a way to distract them. Oh, now I'm in caution. I got their attention. Okay, there's no way they could come up from behind me. There he is. That's the scary one, the glowy one. I didn't see a bloater. But I did put a few of them on the Barbie. And, um, 
no robot no robots were hurt in the takeover of Grey Garden. Okay, now we're gonna switch over to Stabby. Stabby? Are there any of them still alive? Carrying too much. Oh, you know what? I think there's a sum underneath. Let's go ahead. What am I carrying too much of? Let's, um... I'm carrying two pounds of... So let's drop a, a baseball, drop a bone, uh, oh, there's so many, I'm carrying all good stuff, I really can't just drop things. Let's drop the hide and the teeth. Okay, I believe that we have some people under us, some ferals under us that were... Yeah, they didn't like that. I don't know where they went. I think the one that was stuck over there on the rail actually tried to come up around that way. Yeah, I'm still in caution, but I don't see him. All right, let's um, drop save in case something crashes. I'm just going to check for, um, I'll take his, his tag. Or uh, bio fluid, I think it's called. I could take tags. Tags don't weigh anything. leave the meat we don't can we carry the nuclear yeah we'll leave the meat we don't need meat we don't need that kind of meat anyhow um i will take oh i took his tag already Ceramic, I need that. I'll come back for all the Oh, I see you, buddy. I see you. Where are you? I'm gonna try and come up here. No music is playing, so he's not much of a. But um, even one hit could give me the disease. 
There he is. There's two of them there. Let us try and take his head off. There. And there is your friend. I'll use that critical just to get rid of him, you know? Okay. Uh, we can pick up tags. We can pick up anything. It doesn't weigh. Pick up anything that doesn't weigh anything. And of course, I'm looking for, I think it's called, um, something fluid, biofluid, or something like that. Um, That's what we use to... Oh, there was your head. That was your head on the bridge. The biofuel is used to... Um, create the cure. So you, you always pick that up. Make room for that. Uh, that's your... Highest priority. Okay. Um, robots are happy. Uh, let's go ahead and shoot this. And we will claim. Take ownership. Okay. Let's transfer all of our junk. Claim the, schem the schematic finally. And um, let's go ahead and build some defenses. See if we can't. Um, let's see, do we have enough to. Um, yeah, we have enough of everything. So we will. But I don't like to put the. Um, turrets and that on the ground because uh because they you know they could be easily destroyed so we need to keep them up high so uh so they can be easily um attacked We need some wood. We can take this steel as well. We'll take this wood. We'll build like a little uh, turret stand as we did in Sanctuary. I don't think this, uh, the robots on that make a lot of noise, so I probably don't need a lot of defense but we're gonna we're gonna build it up we're gonna build it up good so we don't lose uh, sanctuary I mean not sanctuary uh, we don't lose uh, this as a uh, as a settlement as we did with red rocket my greatest failure. Okay. Oh, you know what? We could clear all this out. Uh, our our things are linked. All of our uh, all of the uh, sang all of the settlements are linked. So um, whatever one has in the uh, And the thing they all have, you could use them 
in any settlement. So we are going to go ahead and ensure that this settlement is as safe as all others. Plus it gives us a little foothold um, in case we are running around somewhere and get into super trouble. We could always duck in here, get a drink of water, have a safe place to sleep. So settlements um, are good safety sanctuaries. out but am I getting over here oh the the wood okay yeah nice um I'm not sure where any of the uh let's do um let's let's build up on top and just make a little uh mm, what do you call it? Uh, a little, a little, uh, little township on top. Um, let's go ahead and. That there. Okay. And, um, just kind of going with what things feel, you know? Um, well, I would like to do that, but I really can't. Unless, can I put it here? Okay, and then we will build off of that this way. Okay. This is going to be the, the platform. the the center open so that um, we could get sunshine into the um, into the little section there and um, you know this really I'll probably take down because we're really just going to build uh, turrets here. This will be the the defense. So let's keep our defense at like sixty ish. So much like um, much like uh, Sanctuary and I think Abernathy okay so we are at a 20 let's go ahead and um, 
You know what? Maybe we could just have like one every other. I was thinking about putting a, uh, a level two in there, but that takes up a lot more uh, materials. And we, we uh, want to put as many guns as we can here. So if we put more guns equals more firepower, meaning that we can um, defend more. How about something like right here? Defense at 55. Okay. Um, how, about, how about if we put one here just to um, protect the entrance? Get one there and there. Actually, that is not a bad idea. Can... So our defense is at sixty-five. So if they tr if they do come up the stairs, they're going to be greeted with um, two guns. Two nasty, nasty, rapid fire weaponry. Okay, we leave the, the center open so that. Um, so let's go ahead and fix it up so it looks. Uh, I guess just not floating. No, we don't want that. We want this one and. Go. Uh, no, those are too short. What about the big tall ones? That'll work. So at least it looks like um, they are being. I'm gonna have to sneak down. Can I sneak down? I cannot. All right. Um, Wanted to look at least like it's um okay now what are you supposed to do to move it? Supposed to be a trick to um, move them. There we go. You gotta hold down the A button. Okay, let me put one there. Let me grab it. There are you. Here you are. We'll hold down the A button. Push it out. Okay, maybe if we drop down. Okay, 
think squat, uh, sneaking is not going to do it. All right, so. There, it looks like uh, posts are holding up the whole structure. doesn't want to turn green. Let's um, let's go out here and see if we can do it from here. smaller one there okay oh that smaller one don't work don't look right from a, from a distance So at least it's not blocking the, the turrets. All right, so we have a 65 defense, so that should be well enough. Um, let's go ahead and put a bed in here. We're not gonna put any humans or anything, but in case we need a place to sleep. We'll go ahead and drop a bed. Right there. There we go. All right, now um, we need to rescue uh, the survivor from ration from the ration bridge. Um, where is that anyhow? From our location, okay, so it's way over here. Um, we're gonna have to make our way through or past um, past the uh, arc jet which is like right here I'm thinking the safer route is to um, approach it from sunshine tidings because right around here is a little church and I'm not sure if where 
in the ration he might be in the center where you got to get the passwords to unlock it uh from um, the other survivors that we have he's probably right in the front yard surrounded by zombies until we talk to him and then um then they're no longer friends so that's uh, that seems to be the uh, mo with these guys so uh let's um let's go ahead and make our way to uh we'll uh cut up this way towards the road then we're gonna cut across here to sunshine tidings then uh come down uh and clear out you know we could probably uh clear out them fairly easy we just gotta find the survivor and of course um don't kill him so we'll have to come here to sunshine why do i have two people at sunshine tiding oh i put a i put a um i put a recruitment beacon there i completely forgot and uh, i'm like why do i have two people <laughs> um i gotta make sure their defense is good too um because they will turn on me and then they come and then they all become zombies so uh let's go ahead and make our way up north and then we're gonna cut west and since every, not everybody is lewis and clark we're gonna make our way uh towards sanctuary and then we're gonna hang a left Yeah, I think we have enough ammo to get there. Let's go ahead and get a drink. Um, do we dump everything? Yeah, we did. Um, we're at 188. I want to make sure I'm not carrying anything more than what we need. Um, we could drop the rags. We keeping this hazmat suit on in case we run into a rad storm. We're trying to avoid as much radiation as we can. Okay, uh, if we take the train tracks. Train tracks will take us right up to the road, but I think like right around here, there are some crashed trains and they um, normally have barrels near it. So we'll try to avoid that. I think we could take this little walkway here and, and then it will, uh, it will yeah, see, this little walkway will fall into a road, which I think is attached to the road that we take for um, arc jets. And then, um, then we could go ahead and come back up this way. So let's take, actually, let's take this road this way and then make a right at the, at the um, next road. I'm gonna keep my gun out. Sun out, gun out. Sun's out, guns out. Okay, there's um, there's a homie just hanging. Oh no, there's two of them. Never mind. If there was just one, I'd shoot him. But since there are two and they are not um, particularly interested in me, I will just. Let sleeping dogs lie. Okay, so somebody or something is acknowledging my presence. Up here is a spawn point. And as we've seen before that, um, 
this game has changed the spawn points and and what is typically in the base game <laughs> so uh, what building is this is this arc jets this is arc jet so Frag mine is in there. Okay. So let us make our way. We'll make our, like I said, we'll make a ride at the road. We'll uh, go ahead and pick some flowers. How much are we carrying again? I forget. I, I don't want to get overloaded. I think we jumped everything. Yeah, we did. Um, somebody or something. Okay, something is... I think this is the road that we need to turn down. No, we need to go towards the overpass and catch this. This is actually, I think, like a freeway. Freeway overpass, which is right up there. So, you know what, as a matter of fact, I think in the, in the base game, there are either um, rag stags down here Dogs or bears? I'm not sure. We have not ran into a bear so far. And knock on wood, we don't. Not for a long while, because I don't think we are strong enough to do to, to go toe to toe with a bear. Okay, so it's rag stacks. Okay, nice. Um, we have plenty of food. We don't need to. Yeah, we don't need to attack what we don't need. Just don't be aggressive, and everything will be okay. Don't be, be making those weird ass sounds either. Don't be weak making those damn weird ass sounds. Are you gonna be attacking me? What put me in danger? Okay, I think I saw some dogs ahead. Oh. Shot a little too high. That was a warning shot. I am armed and dangerous. <laughs> Kinda. I will shoot. Sick him. Get him. Get him. Get him. Oh my god, come on, die already, damn it! Oh. Oh, 
Oh, I thought you were a freaking deer. Got to build up my crit. Oh no, not there. I don't want to shoot him in the chest. Rug, get the hell away from me, deer. Finally. Oh my god. Bastards. Um, I didn't see the sign. Okay, good. I don't know if they hit me or not. I'm pretty sure I shot off their arms before anything. I gotta drink. I gotta take a, a, a drink of coffee. Oh, that was heart racing. Should um, kill these damn deer since they are the ones keeping me in caution. Okay, they've all left. Nice. All right. Ah, uh, I think now I'm back in caution again. Who got? Oh, okay, hidden caution. Hidden caution. The whole cycle. Um, take a look at the map. Yeah, so here we are. Um, so the overpass. So we need to start heading to our left. Do this is this is this overpass. So we need to start heading to our left. I believe this is the overpass that the Brotherhood are in. Hunters are stalking you. Great. Um, I'm going to... Um, yeah, there's Walden Parn right there. So let's, uh, let's make a quick left. We're going to run. Yep, there's where we rescued the guy, I think. I think that's where I rescued him. We're going to run and we're going to run until we get to Sunshine Tidings. Um, I'm going to put a place marker. Okay, so we're running a little too far to the right. Oh shit, that's the behemoth um, thingy. Got to gotta keep moving. I'm in caution. Hunters are no longer a threat. Good. Either I lost them or uh, something else killed them. Okay, now we are in Sunshine Tidings. Um, we put weapons just about towards any and every entrance. Put a little sleeping shack on the top.
Hey, where is everybody? I said I got two people here. Oh, now it says I don't have any people here. Will they all leave? Alright then, that's fine. I thought I did still have Mr. Feelgoods as a, uh, as a, you know, a worker bot here. But I guess he just up and left. Okay, well there there are plenty of defenses here. Oh, I didn't realize that we had uh, this thing kind of um, sticking over. So uh, let's go ahead and make it look as as if it's not floating get this one here and we'll get this one here okay um same thing here, we'll get a big one. And then a smaller one. Um, that one still looks floating. Let's grab that one, and let's put a bigger one in then. And, um... Do the same here. I think we could probably put a smaller one there. Um, hostiles have been attracted to the energy and the sounds of sunshine tides. Okay, so that means we need to, um, and since barrels cannot jump, we are a little bit safer up here. Let's bring them on. Bring them on. How about if we attract them again, huh? We'll just shoot a flare in the air. Dinner bell! What's the defense we have here? Oh, we're at 84. Yeah, we gotta... I'm pretty sure there are some gaps in the defense. <clears throat> but, um... But we'll see. We'll see how it goes. I kind of want to build a, uh, a, sir a siren and see if that attracts them as well. Just, uh, you know, just to uh, get this, 
get them here and there it goes. Never mind. Where are they coming from? There they come. Okay, they're going to try and walk around the outside. They're going to probe our defenses. They're going to find that our defenses are quite strong. I doubt if any of them are going to make it to the... Uh, I doubt if any of them are going to make it to the barn. Okay, so they're, they're coming from there, from there, from there. None come from over here? Doesn't seem like it. Oh, one did make it to the barn. So much fog, I can't see where they are. But they're still coming. He's still firing. Um, I think it's over. That's usually the sound of the turrets going back to sleep. Oh. There's still there's still some stragglers. Get your popcorn. I should I should have warned you to get this is a popcorn moment. Any more? Any more? I should probably um build one of those uh, sensors here as well. I think we're done. Um, yeah, I think. Oh, hold on. I got one here. You got one over there still. Hold on. Let's shoot over there. We may have to go over there and stab him in the head. Who are they shooting at? Oh! And another one coming up. Oh, we got one that did actually make it in towards the barn. Sneaky fella. Oh, here comes some more.
that guy. We need to... Yeah, make him explode. He's the one who gets us all sick! Unfortunately, with the, uh, with the, oh, damn it, see what I mean? That's, that's what they do. They blow up and they shoot whatever this stuff is. I think I, I think I gotta wait. Oh, okay. I think I gotta wait until, um, till after the action to find out if I am infected or not. I think I was high enough and far enough away from his, um, from his, uh, blast radius. I don't see any more. Give it a few more minutes. Make sure we're not going to get a second wave or anything. No, there's one more over there. That was... That was the one that um, do his his green stop everywhere. And it's not like it could hide. He glows in the dark. Come on now. Yeah, they're um, they're still trying. They're they're still. Um, Sending in a few waves. Sun's getting dark. See, there's a roamer over there. I have no chance of hitting him. But maybe the splash damage will get him. And I hope that maybe I pissed him off enough that he's gonna come over here and try to bite my face. Okay, as long as I'm in caution, I cannot sleep. But let's go ahead and see if we cannot um, put a table and put one of those uh, one of those scanner things. Let's see what kind of table do we want it? It's not a very big scanner. But we just put one of these. Right there. Uh, is it crafting? No. Resources? Maybe? No. Power? No. Where is it? Where is it? Miscellaneous. No. Okay. Not in the bed section. 
Wall decorations? No. Not in the power. Resources. No. That's all cannabis. Wild food. I don't think there. I don't think it's in the water. Um, crafting. No. And vault tech. No. Where is it? That's quite odd that it's not in that section. Let's look into this one. Not there either. Or maybe once you build one, that's it? No, here it is, here it is, here it is. Okay, so... Let's turn it so it, it is... Um, facing outwards. There we go. Okay, let's... All right, Sunshine Tidings Co-op Safety. Uh, power Noise plus three. Turret Defense 84. So uh, 84 and 83 is 87. Safe is 20. Workshop Defense is 84. All right, so uh, I misread that. So. As long as I have a defense of 24 or more, um, so four hostiles are still detected in the area. Um, if I have a, a 24 or more, then it will uh, be considered safe. But I think I, I had 24 at red rocket or maybe I was a little bit less I think I might have had like 15 or 20 because uh, I had like three or four of the small turrets um, so yeah all right that's why I lost red rocket um so four hostiles are still detected so workshops I have four safety workshops I have four and um, Safety workshops, safety excluded workshops is 14. So I still need 14 to go. And that's day 11. All right, so there's still some hostiles, but yet I'm not in caution. And it is getting late at night. Um, we're going to stay in the safety of our... Uh, Uh, a little perch we have here. We'll have we'll eat a uh, Salisbury steak. How about a ribeye? So we're having a lot of steak for dinner. Steak, it's what's for dinner. Okay, so there's still four four hostiles in the area, and our turrets are gonna make. You know what I want to do is put a door on this thing. Um, no, it's into this one. And we are we should put one of these. This would be fun, but no, it's not going to fit. Uh, we'll go ahead and put a uh, steel steel door on it. Okay, so that was the turret saying, all it's clear.
Okay, um, we are going to uh, continue this again. We are coming up on uh, just over the two hour mark, so let's go ahead and uh, pick up, pick this up uh, another time. Uh, the next time, we will dis we will rescue from the rationing safety spot. Um, right now, we're gonna let our turrets clear out whatever hostiles are in the area and uh, once that is done then we'll go ahead and take a little nappy nap and uh, go and rescue our survivor so next time we'll do all that hopefully you uh, will join me for that and I'm Guy this has been Generation X Gaming and Commonwealth of DK. Thank you and goodbye.